Esto es que hay un... Se mueve... Okay, I'm just going. Okay. Hey guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Oya for those of you that are new. So today is the start of a series on my channel. A -a -a. It's called the Dear Freshers series. Um yeah, so I'm really looking forward to starting it. This series was inspired by Adesola, who's another YouTuber on here. So shout out to you girl, love you loads. Um yeah, so I'm excited. It's gonna be um like different videos of uni like professional students obviously because of dear freshers but yeah i'm okay so let's get into it this video is called like university checklist things to do or how to prepare before uni okay so first of all my first top tip is to thank god that you actually got to uni in the first place because that's amazing like you got to uni like that's an achievement in itself so you should be so proud of yourself for that okay um <laughs> The second reason is that you should um, join uni Facebook pages. Like, I'm pretty sure majority of universities have Facebook pages for freshers. That we easily meet people, and um, you're able to, you know, start knowing people, seeing a friendly, familiar face, someone that's on your course, or maybe that is living in the same halls as you, or something like that. So it's a great way to meet people. So then, when you're ready for your for induction, that you're like, yeah. And no person gonna be looking out for them. Do you know what I mean? Like for me, I knew three people actually before I joined the university, like before I started my first day of school. But that's because I met them through um a, a uni accommodation day thing that I've explained in a later video because that was a long process. But yeah, so I was looking and two of these people were on my course, so I was already looking out for them my first day. But even before I even ended up seeing them, um it was really good because like some girl just approached me. So you know, like, yeah, just make sure you're, I hope this still makes sense, oh my gosh, okay, just, um, what's the same, let me start again, um, oh my gosh, yeah, so just, as long as you have, maybe you know one familiar person, then it's cool, do you know what I mean, like, you're, you'll be able to settle in more comfortably before you start uni, I hope this makes sense, oh my gosh, okay, number three, my top tip is to try and visit your uni and your the town of your uni before you go whether it's just for a day trip or you're going to stay there for a weekend with your family if it's possible if it's not fair enough I understand that there are loads of international students that could be flying out to UK or to USA or whatever so obviously it could be too far for you but then if you can't go physically to the city then maybe um, try and go on YouTube on the university YouTube channel Go on the university YouTube channel and um, look at like maybe a campus tour of the university. I mean that's what I did. I don't know if it was for the actual uni I went to, but I remember looking on YouTube channels anyway. Or maybe look for some YouTubers that look for like um, videos maybe about somebody who went to your university of choice. They can give you some insight because YouTubers like they go to uni obviously. So like they go to like loads of universities. So I'm sure you'll find someone who does gone to your university or is already at your university and um, yeah okay so tip number four is to start buying things for you obviously before you go to uni like like you know pack, make a list so you're not like getting stressed and stuff and also pack well in advance as well that's a key thing because you don't want to be in the last minute because after the last minute packing for uni it's not fun it ain't fun <laughs> so yeah make sure you pack in advance Obviously, it does depend if you ha if you only find out you have to like you got accepted and the day before, then that's a bit different. And also, if you're an international student, again, or you're coming from far and you can't really afford to like um like bring too much stuff over, then it's fair to pack. But at least, hopefully, if you can try and like maybe arrive a few days before you start university, or if not, you there'll be plenty of shops to be able to buy stuff you need when you get to your university city. So you don't need to worry about that, which leads me on to my next point about like how are you going to get to university. This is um, expired by Ibsmo, shout out to Ibsmo at this point. Um, so yeah, how are you going to get to university? Are you going to drive? Are you going to get a bus? Like, or are you going to get a coach? Are you going to get a train? Are you going to fly? So once you know 
the mode of transport that's a nice phrase mode of transport that you're going to um get there by then it'll be easier for you to know how much luggage you can bring because obviously a plane only has a certain allowance and then a car depends how big the car is do you know what i mean so that will make it easier for you okay guys so what is my next two oh yeah okay guys um accommodation you need to sort it out this links back to my previous point before about joining the facebook page i'm sure there'll be halls pages or like if you if you um you're not living in the halls you're on private accommodation you know um and you're getting like um you have your flatmates and you maybe just met them online then just try and make sure that gets sorted out you know so then once you get it sorted out you can just like relax and get excited for uni because the worst thing you want to do is get stressed be like, oh my god i don't know i'm gonna live i don't know i'm gonna live because that's not fun so like try and get it sorted out um before you start uni obviously it does depend like once you get accepted into the university but i know some things can fall through plans may not work but even if like you're still sorting it out like when you're at uni it's fine next point um Next one. Oh yeah, uni vaccinations, get vaccinations. So like such as the MM, MMR vaccine, I have more info in the description box. So you know you don't want to be like catching stuff. Like you know you don't know where these people are coming from. So you just gotta protect yourself. You know, like just I mean some people may have got it when they were a baby, which is good. But like if you haven't got it, just check with your GP, check with a local doctor, and um see if you, you should be able to. You should be able to get one. So yeah. Um, okay um and my last last point is to just relax you know relax I mean, honestly relax just relax because you need to um you know just enjoy the rest of your summer because when uni comes it comes so just enjoy your summer have fun with your friends your family you know boyfriend girlfriend whatever just have fun with them because like you may not see them for a while so you take pictures take snaps take insta stories instagram pictures do it for the gram all of that love stuff and so look back on that if you're ever feeling homesick when you get into uni do you polaroids yeah polaroids yeah do you polaroids so i say yeah take polaroids take pictures pin them out stick them up in your room so they can look all cute and tumblr <laughs> yeah so definitely yeah just have fun you know like just live in the moment um and like don't get too nervous for uni just you know just be excited yeah anyway guys i think that's it mm, i think that's all my points yeah that's all my points yeah guys so i hope you guys enjoyed um yeah that's all my tips for my university checklist i think that's like i don't know six seven tips i don't know i hope you guys enjoyed anyway um a thumbs up if you liked it don't forget to comment share um, also subscribe hit the subscription box is that right yeah hit the subscription box button down below and also hit the notification bell so you guys are notified every time I upload because videos more uni videos are coming this door is scaring me so more videos are coming and yeah so I'll see you guys for the next video okay bye Okay guys, I hope this goes well because I feel like I've done this for so long. But anyway, um, it's over. Um, yeah, I've got to say you're watching Disney Channel. <laughs> yeah, so um, uni season is upon us. Yeah, as we are in like mid-September now, getting to mid-September. And I am starting a Dear Freshers series. So, yeah. Yeah, so it's exp it's, it was inspired by the YouTuber Adesi. Desola, Adia Desi, love her. Shout out to you, girl. Love you loads. Mwah. Literally, um, she did like a four-part series of like different aspects of uni, like cooking, your course, your flatmates, you know, relationship stuff like that. Mine's a bit different. I'm gonna do like <coughs> my gosh. Mine's a bit different. Oh, I feel so weird. Mine's a bit different just because I'm doing like different videos about different things. So yeah, decided to start a series, my first ever series, well, kind of, like, talking series. I don't know, I feel like I've lost my energy, guys, I don't even know, it's just been a long day, like, it's been long. 
Oh gosh, these curtains got like literally the curtains I'm staying at right now. These curtains literally fell twice and oh my god, you had to get them back up and I was just like oh my days. But I really wanna do this video because I've literally been planning it like planning it this morning and I've been psyching myself up so I wanna like, get into it. Okay guys, so hopefully you can see my head. I really hope I'm in frame, God please. 